been out here on the search for mule deer down in this desert country. We haven't seen a darn thing all morning. But it was worth the look down in this country. Occasionally I see some big, big deer out here. Well, we found some sheds out here. Pretty old, but pretty nice buck. We haven't seen a deer yet, but we're still looking. Um, look at a buck's probably this size or larger. It's pretty desolate out here, not many deer, but uh, we're still looking. We haven't seen anything all morning. It's our opening day, so get back at it and start looking some more. So. Here we are. We still out here looking for some deer. Finally seen two bucks this morning. Pretty small. Pretty small, huh, Jake? Yeah, they're pretty small. We just seen them crossing over the ridge and these three big bucks were across the ridge over here. We didn't quite get set up like we wanted to but uh we'll come back this evening see if they come back off this mountain over here we'll see the front two bucks are are the small young deer we want the last one, the last buck, Jake. Okay, I'm ranging it, I'm ranging it again. 725 yards, Jake, 725. Hit one, Jake. Yeah, I got one. You hit him. Yeah, I know. Holy smokes! Yes. And I got it on camera. Yes. <laughs> Whoa, Jake! I can't believe it. You, you just shot a buck clear across the canyon. Let me zoom back and show show everybody how far we're shooting here. We're shooting across the canyon, same spot where we lost the bucks. On our day three we're on day four now and we found these bucks once again uh, we shot clear across this canyon arranged it at about 725 yards to where the buck we're going over and we shot clear up to there the buck is laying under that tree right in the center but he took a hell of a shot <laughs> man 725 shot that buck at 725 yards Oh, Look up here, Jake. Can you believe that shot? I can't believe that. <laughs> that gun is incredible, isn't it? It is good. Man, this is... We've got that long, long range hunter with a Huskama optic scope in a 7mm mag. Put a buck down at about 725 yards clear across the canyon. Jake made a hell of a shot, and the buck was just moving over the ridge and dropped him. How do you like that shot, Jake? It's incredible. Amazing, it? It's like almost impossible. <laughs> Man. We dial that husk of my scope up and shot and can't believe how accurate that rifle is. Incredible. I'm just looking back up on the hillside there to make sure Jake's buck didn't move anywhere, but uh, Jake made a hell of a shot at uh, 725 yards from this point clear up on the opposite ridge across the canyon. Uh, made a heck of a shot with that seven millimeter with the Huskama scope on it. It's the Remington Sendero rifle. And uh, just making sure that deer didn't go nowhere. And I just seen the other two bucks that he was with move on up the ridge. And uh, but I'm sure we got one. We're on our second to the last day of our hunt here. This is our day four seen a total of five bucks that's including these three these three here but uh it was awesome we had a heck of a hunt it's 
this place just ain't like any other. You know, this is low desert country, so uh, you know, it's hard to find deer in this type of country. But we found a few, and uh, we were lucky, fortunate enough to take one of them. So let's get up there and see what he looks like. Pretty gnarly, huh? Huh? This is nice. It's awesome. <sighs> Found Jake's buck here. Um, you know, this is Jake's only his second deer he's ever taken. But uh, you know, it's an old mature buck and uh, nice buck for him to take. You know, it's not a monster buck, but it's a pretty nice deer for his second one. You know, a big mature buck with some mass, you know, got some character to him. Not much for points, but you know, he's regressing back, but he's an awesome deer nonetheless. And then it's a great buck for Jake, you know, his, and uh, we couldn't have done it without this Remington long range hunting rifle here, and all topped with a Huskama scope. Uh, done a great job for us. Um, I don't think we could have taken this type of shot without this setup here. You know, all we did was range the yardage, which was at 725 yards. And uh, we, you know, dialed up the dial here on the scope, and uh, you know, he held right on as the buck was just rounding the corner, and he slowed down. And Jake took the shot, and uh, you know, he made a heck of a shot, which he made right here, just behind the shoulder, and dropped him. You know, it, that's a long shot, but we couldn't have done it with the long range hunter. But it was a heck of a shot. I'll tell you that. I'm proud of him. Good job, Jake. Thank you, Thad. Mm -hmm. 